You want to know what's crazy? Oh my god. All right. There was a there's a prestigious Smash Brothers competitive player, right? I will not reference him by name because I do not want to potentially ruin deals or companies looking at him. At this point now, a lot of these I don't think people from the companies watch my streams or whatever, but you know, they're worried still, you know, they don't want to be caught with, you know, doing stuff like that. So, you know, they want to keep it squeaky clean. I will not tell you who it was, but I will tell you it was a prestigious Smash Brothers player, a big nigga, a huge player in the scene, one of the top in the world. At one point, while we were on our way to this party, the SOS party, we had some of the edibles on us. I think it's legal to carry it. You just can't be seen consuming it in California. It's not like Vegas where it's completely fucking legal. We were walking up the street and the Smash player, he had a couple other top players in his car. They were all in the car and they called out to me and they were like, yo, Edgar, what's up, bro? And I was like, yo, y'all going to the SOS party? They were like, hell yeah, you gonna be there, bro? I was like, fuck yeah, I'm gonna be there. I ran up to the car just to say what's up. And then I remembered, oh wait, I have some edibles in my pocket. And they were like, yo, you got edibles, bro? Uh, I'm telling you, dudes, you dudes don't know who it is. But these Smash players be going ham. You don't know. You will never know. But it's it's a fact. And these are prestige. I'm telling you, big heads. They were all saying to me, yo, Etika, yo, you got some of those edibles? Let me get some of that shit. I was like, sure thing, brother. I got you. I gave them like about, we had gummy bears. And they were in a package. They were sealed up real nice. Each of the gummy bears was 20 milligrams. Remember how I said 20 milligrams will fuck you up? Each of them were 20. I gave them five of them because there were four of them in the car and I just gave them one extra because why not? And I said to him, I said to the dude before I left the car, the prestigious Smash Brothers, they were all prestigious, but I said to them, don't take these, you know, unless you're ready. These are going to hit you. And they were like, oh yeah, that's fine, brother. Fuck it. I'll take it. It's no problem. And we were like, all right, if you're sure. I ran away from the car, left them with the edibles, and they drove off to the party later on, right? Let me tell you something. I did not see those guys at the party. I only saw, actually, I only saw one of them. And he had a story to tell on his own. He had a story to tell. That nigga said, yo, bro, you fucked up those niggas. That nigga's got fucking... Gone! They said, because you know, the edibles don't hit you right away. So even if they were driving, they were just going to park at the party and get out. The edibles don't hit you for two hours. You all know this. So, I mean, they weren't going to be in any trouble or anything. They could just call Uber afterwards. But I guess they must have taken the edibles right there in the car, knowing that, you know, they wouldn't smack them until like two hours later. So then, I guess, I don't know what happened, but I was told, yeah, they're fucking gone. Like, they're, they're, they're destroyed. What did you give them? And then, wait, and then, you know, the dude was in the car. He said, yeah, I took one too, but I'm used to it. So, you know, it hit me hard, but I'm still good. Those dudes got fucking gone, destroyed. So I don't know what it is with California and putting this super high amount of THC in all their fucking edibles, but it was goddamn insanity. Those Smash players, all of them got fucking sent out the room. Born, twisted, defeated, KO, nigga, fatality, nigga. It was crazy. Game, <laughs> game, nigga. It was over. It was over for those boys. I don't know, man. Like, so when he told me that, I was like, God damn. And the Smash player who it was is usually very... So I was like, wait, I wish, I wish to God. That Smash player knows who he is as I'm saying this. I wish I could have seen how fucking twisted you were off them fucking eddies, bro. He said, that motherfucker hit me up later like, yo, bro, that's some good shit. I was like, hell yeah, nigga. Oh, my God. Because, you know, like in Cali, it's not fully legal. So, you know, you have to have the connections. We had to connect. And we got to the business. And God damn it, it twisted, niggas. That player got fucked up, bro. I, 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 oh, man. So, anyways.